Okay, guys, I'm back. Uh, here's my second video of my obscure movies that I want to talk about throughout the month of May. I'm going to do it all the way to like May the 31st. Um, number two is a film from the er, uh, from the mid 70s that I've never seen before. Well, you know, until like a couple years ago, I never saw it as a kid, and it really isn't a kids movie. It says rated PG, but it really has a lot of stuff that are not for kids, especially some of the uh, imagery. But it's still a fun movie, and it's called The Astro Factor. I know you can't see that those words because they're too. The print is so small. The print is so small nowadays. Let me move back a little bit. I want you guys to see. Uh, move the get my posters in there. Okay, much better. Okay, I'm gonna read the synopsis quick. It's got a little paragraph here. I'll read it. Um, basically, The Astro Factor is demonstrating that a little knowledge is a dangerous thing. A convicted strangler studies the paranormal and and finds a way to render himself invisible. It's like kind of like a take on the Invisible Man or um, Hollow Man with uh, Kevin Bacon. Anyway, uh, to continue, once he escapes, he sets out to find and eliminate the five women who testified in his prosecution. Uh, similar, it, it also has some uh, a little bit of essence of the movie Shocker done by Wes Craven, which is a another hidden gem that I've seen. Um, a police lieutenant, Robert For Foxworth, sets out to safeguard them and bring the invisible killer to justice. Basically, that's a premise that, yeah, we've seen before in other movies, but it works really well. I think that, you know, the, the, the visuals, you know, are really top-notch for the 70s. There's no bullshit CGI. There's no shaky cam. I can actually see the, the strangler when, you know, he's on screen. It's not too dark, like in some horror films. Uh, actually, I like this movie. Uh, I saw it... Uh, long time ago. I think I saw it back in like 2008 or 2009. Uh, the premise works really well for the film. It definitely helps it just go right above, you know, just being in the same league as the Invisible Man. And uh, it's definitely obscure because I never heard of this movie. Uh, I never saw it on TV. It was never advertised. This, these are kind of the sci-fi films that got forgotten especially in the 70s where you know we had Star Wars of course which was a big one and Alien but uh, this one you know it's not in that league but it's definitely a film that I would check out so if you've never seen The Astral Factor uh, it, you can find it uh, the, the online or you could buy it online for on DVD for real cheap uh, there's a box set to have this movie um, there's a lot of there's a lot of ways to get it. You know, it's a movie that's not it's it may be obscure, but it's not that hard to find. Uh, the cast is pretty decent. I don't remember the names too much because you know it's an obscure cast. It's not like the cast in Star Wars or Alien or any Aliens or anything like that. But if you can track it down, I would advise you watch it. It's just a fun watch. Uh, definitely a premise that works, and you know the visuals are pretty good. And uh, the kills actually, you know, for its time, they were pretty heavy, uh, which would lead to, like, the slasher genre, which had much more gore and much more violence. But this is how it started, you know. 70s were a great era for sci-fi and for horror and for action films as well. So, yeah, Astro Factor is number two. Uh, number three will probably be tomorrow. I'll talk about another obscure gem for you guys. I want you guys to check these films out. Even if you don't enjoy them, your feedback is, is welcome because, you know, it's YouTube. It's a community. I want to know your guys' takes on obscure films, you know, what obscure movies that you can talk about that no one's ever heard of. It can't be cult films, like, you know, cult films that are that, that are well-known, like Evil Dead. Every Almost everybody knows what Evil Dead is. I'm saying movies that I've never heard of in any genre you know, a drama, action, sci-fi, horror, comedy, a documentary, anything, even a TV series is welcome. Uh, I appreciate you guys for watching my videos. Thanks for not quitting on me. I thank you guys so much for doing so much, you know, good and, and leaving those thumbs up. Even the thumbs down is welcome as long as you're not an asshole. Uh, well, I'll be back tomorrow with my next obscure video, uh, obscure films video, and... Talk to you later, guys. Bye.